Well, guess what? That's right, it's Glenn Monroe, the RCM Sky One. Battle Gnome Extraordinaire. Right? Well, it's about that time again. If you can see what I got here, this is called the Wira Tool Check. Tool Check Plus. Hopefully, it's in the metric metric system that I ordered. You know, some of us use the metric system. Is it? Mm. Well, we'll see. Let's open it up. Here's the box that comes in. Weighs about a pound. I ordered it Sunday. Got here. Today's Friday at 8.30. Booyah. Yep, it's the metric one. There it is, kids. Men, women. Can I still say that? Okay. As you can see, yep, there it is. Look at that footprint. Comes in pretty spiffy box. I got this for free, but if you order this metric system and have it just sent to you and pick it up at Amazon or you're sent to your house, it'd be about 80 bucks. I got this for free, but trust me, uh, it, I, they, they said it was a gift, but trust me, all the work I do, it wasn't free. Anyhow, they, they just like to make themselves feel better, the state of Missouri. All right, anyhow, check it out. We got metric sockets. Oh, this doesn't have a button. I guess this is the newer one. This opens up. It just lays out like that. Let's see, we got... Yeah. I'll have to replace one or two of these uh, slotted drivers, but that's okay. We got Posi. Looks like security tor torque. Looks like Allen wrench heads up to... Phillips, pretty large Allen wrench head. What does that say? This doesn't have the button on it. This doesn't come with a button. This must be the older one. I guess it just opens like that. Yeah, the other one has a button you push and it opens up. This one don't do that. That's okay. Less stuff to break, right? Okay. We have, looks like up here. Speed adapter. In case you got a drill or an impact driver. We got a very small ratchet. Oh, that ain't too bad. I had to get this because I can't carry all this junk around with me all the time. And this was like, hey, it's already all in here. And you get a very, very tiny stubby driver. Ooh. Stubby driver. Magnetic, magnetic tip. Yeah, this isn't the one I wanted, but oh well, I can't be picky. Doesn't have a button on it to keep it closed. Now we have a nut driver. There it is, kids. Got a nut driver. And a pretty stout magnet inside this stubby. We got 13, 12, 10, 8, 7, 6, 5, and 5.5. .5. I don't know. Don't ask. Wasn't well, 5.5 .5 you rounded up? Wouldn't that be 6? That's what they teach in school. But anyhow... There's supposed to be a button on this. This one doesn't have it. But anyhow, you have the, the driver. Oh, okay, I guess this gets out of the way so you can get in there. Here's your stubby. It goes right here on the side. This didn't come with the button. This must be an older one or something. 
Oh well, like I said, it's free. I didn't have to worry about it, but I did bust my ass for it. Okay, so we have the world's tiniest. It feels really nice, though. It feels. I'm small, so I'm five foot six. So, yeah, this is right up my alley. For those of us who have to go down one occasionally. Yeah. Broke it in, Missouri dirt. Okay, there it is. The We're a Tool Check Plus metric. Compliments of. Ozark's finest. Yeah, there's supposed to be a button right here that you push and it opens this. See, now it's not locked. I have a feeling that's going to be problematic. Is there a way to tighten that? Well, anywho, if you have to, you can put a uh, the trim slot slotted driver in there. That's what I usually do. Doesn't have one in here. I'd have to get the smaller one. But it has all the smaller Phillips. The Posi. Security torque. Torque. Yeah, Allen wrench heads. The adapter. Metric sockets. Speed bit. I think this is one that's just yeah, this is one that clicks. Yeah, I have to click to hold that in there. All right, there it is, kids. It's not the one I wanted because there's supposed to be a button right here to hold this, keeps this from flying out. See, that's, oh well. I guess you just go like that and open it. Slide it in your case. Beggars can't be choosers, right? Maybe we can put a magnet in there or something. I think there is a magnet in there. Feels like there's a magnet in there. Feels like there's a magnet in here. Maybe that's what's holding it. Yeah, there's a magnet in here. That's what it feels like. So it's held closed by a magnet probably back here or something. That's what it feels like. Yeah, okay. That's cool with me. Don't need a button anyway, right? More crap though. Okay, speed bit for our impact driver. Or if you want to put an extension on your stubby. Let's try this again, kids. Oh, look at that. Pretty snazzy. Then we put our security torque in here because that's usually what I use a lot of. Pretty strong magnet. Oh, okay. Check this out. Watch this. Got to be careful. It pops out. Now watch this. Now it's locked in there. Ooh, yeah, I like that. Now it's locked in there. That's a pretty stout magnet inside this stubby. I like it. It's cool. Okay. Man, this is actually a pretty decent little kit. Then just open it back up. And you might want to swap one or two of these bits out with something you're going to use all the time. The only problem is, let's see. You pull that open, it comes out. Okay, this is a lock. I'm sure this has a lifetime warranty. It's probably limited. The usual stuff. Just keep the stuff and that works and replace it with, you know, something like I find all the time. Anyhow, that's the Vera Tool Check Plus. Vera. Vera. It's German. Right? Good old German made quality tools. Anyhow, there you go. What else is in the box? They gave me a sticker. All right, so there we go.
Look how small that is. Like I said, my hand is about, that's about seven inches. Maybe eight. That's eight inches. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, it's four inches wide by... Does it sound on the back? Anyhow, you get the point. It's as big as my palm. Half the size this way, half the size that way. Full size, half your hand. That's probably what it is. It's like full size of your palm. How tall is your typical German? Right? Probably about my height. Probably seven. I don't know. I got family from Germany. All right. Yeah. So I'm five foot six. There you go. The length of my hand, half the half the length, wide. Yeah, this one doesn't have the button on there. I don't know why. Maybe they upgraded it. They said ah, we don't need the button anymore. Let's just ditch the button and put a magnet in here. Yeah, I like this. It's pretty cool. This works. Now, would I pay eighty dollars for this? I'd probably pay about forty. I'd probably about sixty. Everything seems high quality, but it seems like, yeah, I can tell this is, these bits ain't no punk. I can tell, I was like, oh, these are, they just didn't put the couple of the ones that I would have put in there. Yeah, this is nice. It's pretty nice. I'd probably pay 60. That'd be as far as I would go. But anyhow, there you go. Glenn Monroe, the Roman Gnome, the RCM Skyhorn. Cool tools we can use. Like I said, this pretty much covers all your stuff. Pretty much covers all of it, right? You got a, a driver, ratchet, right? Or impact bit. Also doubles up as. Yes. Yeah, I'm happy with it for free. <laughs> Would I pay for this? Yeah. You know, once I got the goop around with it a little bit. Okay, you can't use that in there. Okay. Oh, yeah, you can. Okay, you got to push. Push kind of hard. So there you go. Sounds pretty good. That's how I test it. All right, now we're ready to go. Yeah, I like it. It's going to come in very handy. So, I hope this video helps you out a little bit. If it did, let me know. Make a comment. I haven't been posting very many videos lately. Been very busy. But anyhow, there's your bit selection. I don't know if my, my camera's very good at this. Socket selection. It's color-coded. There's good old 10 millimeter. I find a lot of those every day laying on the side of the road. You're missing one, holler at me, I might send it to you. All right, there's your stubby driver. The ratchet extraordinaire, fits right on top. You just slide that in there. This is in there pretty good. I mean, you probably could just get away with just. Yeah, that's friction fit. So that's what you get, one, two, three. Those are your drivers. Especially this is gonna go to your battery powered or if anybody still uses corded drills or anything. Bit selection. And you can change these out, I'm sure, like which, whichever you like. They also make this an Imperial. I needed the metric because most of the stuff I use is metric. I have a ton of a... Uh, I have another kit I'm going to make that has all the uh, Imperial stuff. I'm going to make something similar to this myself from scratch. I might make a video on that, showing you how to make your own little kit with a little cool little box to put your stuff in. Especially with this, they sell these art, these rails already made like this. Six, seven. The one I'm getting has ten, so I can put two or three extra things on here. Probably your, uh, you know, imperial or extra little adapters, and then yeah, I could probably make something like this. Pop rivet. I got a friend that does a little tack welding. I was like, yeah, make me a little box, bro. Put all this stuff in. But I thought I'd, you know, take advantage of a free gift. Yeah, this will work for emergency response. And, uh, right? 
domestic services. Yeah, I like it. Anyhow, if you've used this or you're interested, leave a comment. See y'all later. Have a good weekend.